I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about the collaborative classroom and I have with me Jeannie Robertson, new faculty in biology. Jeannie, what are you doing in your class that's so exciting? Hey, thanks Mary Pat. I'm really excited to tell you about the iPad and how we're using it in the classroom. Before I used to deliver all the content on every slide and I'd build them in a traditional way. Now what we do is I give them a skeleton of the PowerPoint slide. We're able to talk about concepts and I can ask them to complete the slides so that they are taking responsibility for understanding and learning the content in the class. I can ask students to say, okay, why don't you show me what you've done? And I hand them the iPad and it'll be projected to the entire class. They can then upload it to Moodle directly and receive credit for in-class participation. So in the classroom, uh, can you actually do quizzes and poll students as far as what they've learned and how much they're, they're getting? Mm -hmm. Yes, we've incorporated a daily quiz now in every class. They take the quiz electronically on their iPad and their answers get submitted to me at the podium in real time. I can see each student's response to every question. I can look at the class averages per question. I can tell which answers are being selected that are incorrect because instead of getting a Scantron the day after they take a quiz, I'm getting the results in real time. Can you imagine giving an assignment to your class where they would actually have to create content and use their, their tablet for that? Yes, I actually am really excited about that. So, so far we've talked mostly about the utility of an iPad in a large classroom of 150 to 170 students. But I'm really excited about using this in my upper division classes of 20 students, a lab-based class where I ask students to work in groups and create content using their iPads, using the videos, taking images of the work that they do in the lab and putting it together in a formalized report or um, a presentation. And so I think this will really enable the students to work together collaboratively, to take pride in the work that they do, to showcase their research in a, a very small, intimate lab-based class. If we were to wrap this up, what would you say about using the tablet as a collaborative tool in the classroom? I think it's really exciting. The students are excited about it. It changes the way that I teach and it changes the way that the students learn. The students are now actively engaged in the classroom and they're taking responsibility for their learning. <laughs>